Hello, everyone. This is Maria. So here we we will continue our、uh, tutorial twenty three. So it's about how to figure out、uh, CFG. CFG is quite important for the DV LCD display. So how to say if you download the wrong CFG, it will black your LCD display, and then How to say? You could only buy a boiler from D1 store. Well, D1 store to recover the project. So, uh, I suggest you not download CFG, uh, unless get uh the uh confirmation from the sales engineer. So here, uh, let's say something. Let's try to explain something to you. So here, this is the CFG. So for the CFG, the first name is T5L CFG. I I don't care what's after this, but the first is T five L C F G, and this is the C F G file. It's a bin file, okay. So this one is for our ten point one inch, okay. So when you open this file, you just need to uh, you just see three lines, the first uh, the zero line, the first and the uh second just three lines. Okay, so let's explain to you one by one. Okay, so uh, the first question: What's CFG? Um, how to say? It's the system configuration, including the border, CRC direction. Uh, I mean display di direction from uh horizontal to uh vertical, or from vertical to horizontal, and the ICL store location, and also display parameter settings. And how to edit CFG? Uh, we normally use the actual edit tool. Hmm.、Mm. You you may find others uh in your country, but I I'm not sure. Uh, but uh our tool is Chinese. If you don't mind, we can share to you. And uh the third question. Uh, can can you generate the CFG by yourself? Yes, you can. But Um, I'm not sure at this moment. I I received some request from my customer, uh, when they generate the CFG by themselves, the display uh normally goes into black, and then they will buy a boiler from me to recover the project. So I suggest you to how to say uh get the confirmation from the sales engineer before downloading it. To to avoid some potential questions, okay. So, uh, the first question: Can can you change the safety parameter by yourself? Yes. Uh, still, still better get confirmation, uh, from the own side to avoid any display black. It really caused the display black, and you could only recover it by the boiler, and you will be so frustrated. And you will think even is not good, but uh, so this is what I want to emphasize, uh, CFG again and again and again. Please get confirmation from the one side first, uh, before downloading these files is quite important. Okay, so let's say the CFG settings. Let's say the guide first. So, uh, in this is the development guide for the T5L. This is uh page twenty two. Okay, CFG. So this is configuration list. Uh, is for the system configuration. Okay, this is the hardware configuration. Uh, is in binary data format, and can be edited by software such as Arch Edit. So here, uh, this there is some address zero zero. This is the bus length, and、uh, this is the definition. So here, this is the fixed content. So for the T five L, the first、uh, three file bars is fixed, and this is the、uh, others. So here, you can see、uh, the green one must be、uh, must be、uh, set in the CFG, but、uh, since one zero, I mean ten, you can keep zero. No need to match it in the display. If you match it, uh, sometimes you may cause the display black. Okay, but the green part shall be, uh, shall be matched. Okay, so here this is the five 
this is the parameter configuration. You can see something here. And six, this is for the PWM, SPI, or something others. And seven, this is the WAE. If you want to play some music, when you touch, uh, you share mesh, you share config this part, WAE files. This is the scope for the WAE file. And here, eight location. This is the background picture, SDL. So if you want to show up the background pictures, so you should um, keep the same as here. Okay, and this is touch panel reporting point rate. Uh, normally, just keep the thing as the as this file, and also this is the border rate. So normally, the factory setting is one one five two zero zero. But if you want to change to others, uh, you need to change uh, zero a location. Okay. And here, this is the backlight standby configuration. So, uh, if you don't uh, here, if you don't match uh, config this part, if you select there, so you'll learn it uh, to write data here. You just need to write uh, zero, zero, or, or some others is okay, because it doesn't matter, okay? So let's say it one by one. So here, uh, five, four, 35, four, C, four, three, uh, three, one. This is the fixed part, as I explained to you uh, just um, one, min one minute ago. And here, this is the most important part, 38. So 38 means one, one, uh, sorry, zero, zero, one, 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 zero, zero, zero. It's hex to be. So here, zero, zero, one, 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 zero, zero. Okay. So CRC close, no CRC check, border. Okay, so which means when you touch, there will be a border. And this fail initiali uh, initialization variable space, which means uh, when you download the project to the display, if you set the initial value, it will be show up in the display. But if you select zero, uh, even though you set the initial value, it won't be show up in the display. And also, this is the variable automatic upload setting. If you select one, so when you select uh, auto uh, data auto uploading in the project, so uh, it means when you press uh, press the button, the data will be uploaded to the MCO. So here, this part is quite important. And here, this is touch panel audio control. One means open. Uh, which means when you press, there will be some sound. And this is the backlight, open or zero. And also, uh, this is the display direction. So zero, zero, which means this is the original direction. Uh, zero, one means, uh, means change some angle. So if you want, if the display is uh, vertical uh, for the factory settings, uh, just like the the display as uh, as in my hand, so if you want to uh, show the project in horizontal format, so here you shall match uh, zero one, okay. This is how to uh, how to set the display direction, okay. And here. Uh, zero, uh, 06, as mentioned before, is PWM. You can refer to the development guide. So here we normally write zero, 00. And then 7, this is music file location. If you want to uh, touch the panel and have some music, okay, music sound, you need to change this part. Also, it's hex format. And here, H, this is the background image. So if the background image is 32. Here, you should write 20, okay? So here, none location. This is touch panel reporting point, point rate. Uh, factory setting is 2, 8. Just keep the same. And here, this is the board rate. Now it's 115200, okay? So if you want to change to others, you need to change here. And this is the backlight settings. Okay, 
So、嗯、normally for the second of this line, you normally just write to zero zero is okay. Ah,、uh, but this is the factor. Okay, and here、uh, as um this is for the display calibration or adjust the sensitivity. So if the capacitive touch panel, this is the adjust sensitivity. But if it's the resistive touch panel, is for the calibration. Okay, and also from here twenty seven to、uh, to D is for the buzzer settings. Ah,、uh, I will explain to you for the buzzer setting in ah、uh, in the later tutorial. Okay. Uh, so okay, so today's tutorial is over. See you. See you next time. Bye bye.